Okay, so uh, let's try this one. It says draw all the resonance structures of the following radical. Um, okay, whatever. Let's do it. Um, so, uh, remember resonance for radical uh, reactions, you're going to have to do fish hook areas, right? Because it's uh, the motion of a single electron. So, there, there, right? That's going to make that bond there. There, there, there. It's going to make the primary radical. You guys see that? Is there any other radicals we can make? Yeah, definitely. So, uh, okay. so let's do another one. Okay. Let's make the tertiary radical here. So. Why should we? It doesn't, nothing happened to it. Stay the same, right? Okay. So if it stays the same, you don't move it around. Um, <coughs> is there any more that you guys can think of? Is there another one? Some people are saying yes, some people are saying no. So now they're all saying no. Is there any others you can see? None that I can see. Okay. So, um, yeah, which one of these would be the most favored resonance structure is the best way to say it, right? The, the last one. The very fur furthest here. Why? Because that's the tertiary. This one here is the what? Primary. I know it's hard to see now, but that radicals there. And this one here was uh, secondary. Now remember, these are all resonance structures of each other, right? So if we were to say, so remember resonance is like a hybrid, right? So it looks like the actual structure looks like all of these structures, but it most looks like this one, right? Why? Because this is the most stable. That one's a little bit too. Yeah, and it's a little double, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we should put them. <coughs> so are there any other questions? 